Top fatherless behavior. Having a weird obsession with anime. There's a reason why so many main characters don't know their father. It's because the writers are trying to make it more relatable to their target audience. Playing any games made by Riot. This joke was originally just for League of Legends, however Valorant now exists. And I've seen some screenshots off of Valorant, so let me just tell you I, I know what I'm talking about. Overly using Discord. Now if you use Discord just to talk to your friends or chat with them while playing video games, whatever, right? If you're in Discord dating servers, Discord social servers, I have reasonable suspicion to believe that you do not have the male paternal figure in your life. Like, can you just imagine talking to your father about something like, man, yeah, I was just on this app called Discord where you talk to complete random strangers and they didn't give me the roles I wanted, man. Like, I, I deserve such higher roles. Dyeing your hair an unnatural color. You know what I'm talking about, your blues, greens, bright reds. See, in the wild, in nature, these colors represent toxicity. To me, these colors represent fatherlessness. LGBTQ involvement. This isn't me trying to make fun of something, this is just statistical realism. It is statistically impossible for a gay to possess all five of the following. Math skills. A good relationship with their father. 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 Every time I see pronouns in bio, I just automatically assume. I apologize. Uh, next time I will ask about your father. Becoming a professional athlete. Somehow them single mothers always got sons in the NFL and the NBA. I mean look at this. Kevin Durant, Mike Tyson, LeBron James. Fellas, if you want a son in professional sports, breeder and lever. Choose your path, fatherless men. Professional athlete or furry discord twink. Which is kind of funny because the paths for fatherless women is either dyke or niche internet porn star. Coomer humor. If hentai is your personality, I have very bad news for you. Actually, I think this one's missing a mother. Being a socialism enthusiast. Just because you don't have a father doesn't mean I have to share mine. E-girls and those that support them. You know, buying only fan subscriptions, female Twitch streamers. I mean, when was the last time you heard Pokimane on stream talk about her father? Alright, so her mother and father are still married. Ah, uh, I guess I'll take the L on this one. However, Jarvis, pull up her relationship with her father. Okay. Okay, I'll take another L. Apparently they still doing good. Okay, well, who the fuck is that, though? Hey, I gotta get on the scoreboard somehow. Okay, Pokemane's pretty mild when it comes to e-girls. Them booby streamer only fans girls definitely ain't got a good relationship with their father. And if they do, their father got some weird fetish they ain't talking about. 